for him too. Man, hell yeah. And you probably can't hear it like you should. But <laughs> behind the scenes, y'all probably don't, you know what I mean? What's that good? Just to eat the ur the urky. Urkel before the cool juice. The after cool juice Urkel. Oh man. I'll take the mic on. We're live on both. Cool. I mean a pregame shot. And then and then do a sipper? Yeah, we can do that. Appreciate it. Ah! This show is about. This ain't gonna be on here. This is behind the scenes. You gotta pay five dollars to see this. Sure. To say so, you know what? Welcome to behind the scenes. If you pay five dollars to see this, appreciate it and love you much. Can I say that? I can say that. Sure. Cool. I'm a nerd. All right, let me put my hat up because my eyes look mad dark underneath my hat. I already got that pigmentation issue with my eczema. Oh man. You know, this is gonna be fifteen dollars for behind the scenes. I'm giving y'all some old information that you ain't supposed to be knowing. Yeah, cuz let me see what your levels look like. Tell you a little something for me in there. Yo, yo. Mmm. Yo. Which one is you? She right here. Yo. Yeah. Yo, yo. Alright. Wait, that towards you. This right here is your front. Okay. You're gonna hire, boy. Alright. I'll be smooth with that thing, cuz. Thank you. All right, y'all, so welcome to the Behind the Scenes of the Beats and Brews podcast. I'm your boy, Rob Dorsey. And y'all know who this is, don't you? No, no, Jay. Boom, just like that. So, this is the first time we're doing a, a vlog along with the um, podcast. So, bear with us. Whatever looks bad or whatever, put it in the comments. Whatever looks good, put it in the comments. Either way, like, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Four, three, two, one. What's up, 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 Del? Cause we in the building. Word up. How you feeling, man? Oh, man, feeling good, man. Word, it's like, it's a good, well, well you know, before we get started, man, let me do this. Um, Today we had an unfortunate incident in Delaware. Um, now, you know, people get killed every day. It's never a good thing. Um, sometimes it happens in big numbers. You know, and sometimes it's a single solitary incident. What's blown up right now is we had an officer uh, murdered today in a Wawa parking lot. Number one, don't violate Wawa that way. Number two, <laughs> just don't don't be killing people. What is wrong with y'all out here? Like, it's I'm ashamed to even have to say that to people out here. Don't kill nobody. It ain't right. Like, you know, this man just. Yeah, that's an unfortunate situation. You man. know, he's not he he's not gonna be able to uh, see his family no more. You know, he they not gonna be able to see. Well, they gonna see him again, but it ain't gonna be how they remember him. You know, and it's a it's a it's a sad thing. So I just wanted to show send send some love out there. They didn't release his name yet, um, and you know, just wanted to pay some respect on the Beats and Brews podcast. You know. Uh, it's bigger than being an officer. That's a man. So, at the end of the day, and he's also a brother. Like, he's a black man. And to me, I just, mm -hmm. I don't think anybody celebrating that death is worth even talking about. Right. But, um, you know, just show respect to life and give love to everybody that's, you know, that's feeling it. You know what I mean? That's all you can do, and that's all you that's all you really have to do. But um, you know, on to what we're doing today. My man Nerd Up J then did some old dun diggity stuff. I don't even know 
what's going on here, man? What is it that you that you brought oh, man, to this right now? Should we got um session? <laughs> boom sauce. Boom sauce. Who do that? Who's is this? Lord Hobo Brewing Company. Lord Hobo Brewing Company. <laughs> Word. <laughs> Lord Hobo. Who the fuck? What the fuck is this? I never heard of these folks. What's that? What's that? Uh, Lance Lance Younger. Okay. Maybe I think that's his. Uh, it might be Younger. His uh, signature. Let's see. You gotta see where they uh, where they located at, man. Boom. Okay. From the hills of Woburn, Massachusetts. <laughs> we do need some information on them, no, huh? Shit, I'm over here. I'm slacking on my Mac. Or is it, oh, I say Massachusetts, I'm tripping. <laughs> is it? Yeah, that's... That... Boston, Massachusetts. You know what I'm saying? Massachusetts is not a state. It's in Massachusetts. You know what I'm saying? Massachusetts is not a state. You know what I'm saying? Massachusetts is not a state. Massachusetts is a state. Boston, Massachusetts? Boston is the oh, city. Oh, the city? Okay, okay. <laughs> I thought I was tripping. <laughs> He's like, yeah, that's one name for a city, bro. <laughs> Where? It's that boom sauce. Oh, snap. That is that boom sauce. It do that to you. It make you forget. Now, is M.A. Massachusetts or you is throw that some of the, uh You know, you got to... Uh, yeah, that's Massachusetts. You got to find our... Uh, Effects, yeah. You know, oh, get, some noise. Uh, 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 <laughs> you know what have been perfect for this? Huh. Fucking John Madden. Oh yeah. You know, <laughs> you know his famous boom. You right. Know? True, true. <laughs> boom, baby. <laughs> boom. Yo, man. So I got their website up, and I mean, do they got other things? It, uh, it looks bananas. I don't know. All I see is I'm seeing boom sauce all over the place. Now look at that. They 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 be around Boston. Okay. You know what I mean? Um you know what since we in Massachusetts with it, let's uh let's focus around some of the some of the hip hop artists that came from out of Massachusetts. <laughs> How many you know? Holy motherfucker, I know it's fucking <laughs> Benzino. <laughs> he came from Massachusetts. From Boston. Oh snap. I don't know nobody else, dog. I had no clue. And I only know that from uh you know what was that last year or Eminem nah when that shit happened he got shot uh, oh wow he was going to his mom's funeral or something like that he got shot going to his mom's funeral yeah I think his cousin shot him or something like that his cousin shot him on his way to his mom's funeral some old crazy shit but um yo can you look at the camera with me real quick like (laughs) his cousin shot him yeah that's some weird shit that's some crazy shit Jesus Christ who else? Who else is from there? I feel Jehovah like, Jireh, huh? I feel like somebody else is from there though. Uh, All right, we got say somebody from back in the day though. Mark Wahlberg, Marky Mark. Oh yeah, <laughs> he was an artist before. <laughs> Where? <laughs> it was, the vibrations. Yeah, yeah. Um, pump up the volume. I think. I think that was him too. I don't know. You know what I mean? Good vibrations. You <laughs> 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 heard that joint? Oh Where? shit. Recently, my I just heard girl. that shit recently. I think they be playing that shit at. Yeah, uh, <laughs> they, playing they, was, sure. they was playing it somewhere. I was at a store. <laughs> um, Yo, I'm trying to think who else though, man. My home girl, uh, Aly- Alyssa Marie. She is, uh, she is from uh, Massachusetts. She's around Boston area. You know, we did this song "Hippie Love." You know what I mean? She was. You remember "Hippie Love"? Mm-hmm. And uh, she was on. She was on there. Uh, we had the. Uh, we had the bars. Like uh, it was wordplay cir- circling around, uh, 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 boy meets world. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, yeah, it was that was good. She's she's dope. She's actually looking for some beats right now. So I'm trying. You know, if you got some beats, send them to Alyssa Marie. It's uh, contact Alyssa Marie at gmail dot com. The Alyssa is spelled A L Y S S A. Yeah, I'm gonna make some and send them to her. You know what I mean? Try to get some get some dope joints. So let me let me see if I can find Lord Hobo on um, Wikipedia because <laughs> it does not exist. Jeez, like that's okay. Y'all got terrible branding. Like I like the beer. 
But y'all ain't got no Wikipedia, man. I'm trying to find some information out on y'all. You know what I'm saying? The, the website oh, don't even. I, I found something. Okay. You did? I knew it was somebody from back in the day. I couldn't think about it. Uh, oh, oh yeah. If this is right, but um. Oh, they do have more. It says, it says Guru. Guru? Yeah. From Gangstar? Yeah. Oh snap! Yeah. Shout out, well, rest in peace, Guru. Yeah. Yeah. From Roxbury. Yeah. Rest in peace, the Guru man, a uh, 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 Massachusetts legend. Roxbury. Yeah, I thought he was from New York. I thought he was too. He said from Roxbury, Massachusetts. Yeah. Like not Roxbury, Roxbury in Boston. Roxbury? Yeah, Roxbury in Boston. You know, you remember uh, Night at the Roxbury, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> they was playing that type of music that uh that uh, uh Marky Mark was making. <laughs> Good fire, pretty sure. <laughs> so yeah. Oh yeah. shit! Uh, we tripping. Yeah. Okay. Now, now we back. Okay. We can't forget about fucking new edition. Was they in Massachusetts? Yeah, it was from Boston. Oh, yeah, they was from Boston. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh snap! Boston boys stand up. New edition. What's yeah. happening? Bell, Bill, 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 just had the whole story. Yeah, true. Yeah, they was getting it in out there. Mm-hmm. Oh snap! Yeah, they basically hip hop. And you know, even if you don't, yeah, that's why I said Bill Bill DeVoe. Yeah, you know, I mean? so, you know that's <laughs> where they mesh the singing with the rapping. Then right, you know right, I mean? very so. true, very true. Poison, poison, mm-hmm. P- yeah. poison. Mm. Yeah, other than that though, I don't know. You know what I mean? Besides local artists, yeah, you know what I'm saying. True. But yeah. I haven't, you know, listened to them myself. Oh. So you know, is, what I mean? uh, is that where? No. Wait, is he from there? Is that where Macklemore is from? Or is he from Seattle? He's from Washington. Is he from Washington? Macklemore? He's from yeah. Seattle. He's yeah. from Seattle, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yo, I swear to God, he looks like Skeeter from Doug. <laughs> That's Skeeter right there. No bullshit. Don't call Macklemore at that name no more. Mm-hmm. He's Macklin no more. He's Skeeter from now on. Call him Skeeter. He's been off the radio for some time, right? He's been off the radio? Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. He, after he dropped that, you know, be proud of whatever record, he just disappeared. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? I think he was trying a little too hard to be. And you know what I, you know what I think? Um, it kind of, uh, I think it probably was a, uh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, you know, that, that, that time where he gave that uh, speech mm-hmm. when Grammys? he was guilty of his own success. Oh yeah, about talking about Kendrick yeah, and all that. Yeah, Kendrick should have won it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> yeah, I mean that that was a. I don't know. Uh, it was probably a slap in the face to the academy because, like, I yeah, mean, the Grammy too. people was like, "I gave you this because you yeah. look like us." Yeah, and, and, and I believe. How dare you? He said that's when he was having his interviews about the whole, you know, white privilege thing and all that. Yeah. But uh. Yeah, I don't know, man. Word. Other than other than that, that that's the only people I could think of: Benzino, mm-hmm. Guru, and Bell Bib DeVoe. True. Uh, what's that? Different ones? They got different. Uh, yeah, they do got a couple different ones now. Like so, Constellation Prize is one. I right, we're talking about different beers from this brewery, Lord Hobo Brewing. All right, Lord Hobo Brewing Company. They got a website if y'all want to check it out, Lord Hobo. Yeah, LordHoboBrewing.com. They got Constellation Prize. They got Boom Sauce. Mm-hmm. And they got Steal This Can. Excuse me. Now, I don't trust Steal This Can because, I mean, I, when I see it, I, it automatically makes me think <laughs> of Still Reserve. You know what I mean? And I, I just can't trust that. We got bad days on that. Sure. Bad nights. You believe yeah. they got that in a 40 Before. ounce? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I can't believe they got still reserving a forty yeah, ounce, man. Yeah, yeah, that's that's real. That is disgusting. Um, but anyway, so yeah, boom sauce. Let's see if they got a little background. They have no background. It's just a picture. Mm. You're making me mad, Lord Hobo. You are making me mad, and I'm gonna tell you why. We just went through a a little, you know, thing where we had, uh, you know, a good marketed beer, and it was terrible tasting. So, you know, please don't follow in those footsteps because, like, your marketing is pretty good. I love the can. I love the way it looks. You know what I mean? Go ahead. Get a little look at that again. Mm-hmm. Scott, 
that. You know, you got a little bit of that on there, mm, some that, and you even got a little signature on there. That's dope. But uh, you don't. I, I'm not. I'm. I'm. I'm having trouble finding your information on your website. It's all social media. I don't got no history, man. You know what I mean? What's going on? Um, so, I mean, well, I guess since you got it up here, let's get the uh, get your social media out there. You got an Instagram. They're on uh, Lord Hobo Brewing on Instagram. I'm going to follow you guys. Got to re-log in because I cleared my cookies earlier. So, re-log in. We follow y'all on Instagram. Uh, let me see your Facebook. On Facebook. They are Lord Hobo Brewing Co. Boom. Make sure I go check them out. Like their page. Now let me get out of there. Still got work to do. Twitter. Y'all on Twitter. What y'all at on Twitter? They are at Lord Hobo Brewing on Twitter. Follow them. They're dope. I think. I have not yet tried them. So. So far, cuz. What do you think? Like, because... They don't have no history on here. Like, they don't have... They don't got nothing. They got an email address. I don't know, man. I'm hoping it just speaks for itself. All know? right. So... I could dig that. Maybe that's their, you know, uh, evil genius thing. Maybe. You know? Maybe. Because I can't find them on Wikipedia. They ain't got the info I need on their website. I'm looking for history. If y'all know something about Lord Hobo Brewing, comment. Give me something. Send it to us. You know what I mean? And then, matter of fact, find us on Facebook under Beast and Brews Podcast. Because we got a Facebook page. And also, we got a YouTube now. It's only got one video on there right now. It's a vlog of a... Ooh, I forgot. We got to announce an event today. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ooh, no doubt. We got something good in the works. All right, so yeah, we um. What's that, cuz? Well, what we got in the works? Yeah. All right, you know what? I'm gonna tell them. I'm gonna tell them. We got a local brewery here in Delaware called Argillas Brewing Company, and uh. Shout out Argillas. Boom. What'd you say? Cause Shout out Argillas. Hell yeah. <laughs> now, unlike you know certain people. They actually got their history out there. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate stuff like that. I want to know where you're coming from. Right. What's happening? <laughs> what's going on? Like, what you what you done did? What's your rap sheet? Right. Talk to me. Now, Argelis has been around for a while, man. And in Delaware, they are one of the best breweries here, you know? Um, I think their main competition is probably Miss Pillion. And that's it. Miss Pillion? Yeah, there ain't nobody else in Delaware brewing like 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 them. You, I can't you know, say that. I can't say that. I can't vouch for that. Nah. Nah. Well, I know where your heart's at. You feel me? I mean, I like Two Stones like a lot. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? I have to try some more. Two. I got to try some Two Stones. Only had one from there. They got. I'm gonna say like they had this. Uh, I'm gonna say it's an oak barrel. Mm. Uh. Yeah. It's. Uh. I want to say it's the high. High West or High Noon, one of them. Oh, where? High West. High West, yeah. yeah. The whiskey? Yeah. It's aged in them barrels. Okay. Yeah, that, that's pretty dope. Um, but yeah, yeah. I, I, I wouldn't say that they... That's the only competition. Right. I didn't know Miss Billion was from here. Yeah, they right in Milton. They like 40 minutes away from here. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Where? Okay. Oh, yeah. Fordham and Dominion. I forgot about that. They... They here too. Um, that's where the R two Hop two festival is. It's in Dover. Okay. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. We now you already know me. Like I can't vouch. For, I can't go in. Oh shoot! I can't even say that right now. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> all right, boom. So I love Argelis. Boom. That's on top. Uh, we put out a vlog. All right. We put out a vlog. A behind the scenes joint. It was a documentary. Of a beer that we're doing in collaboration with Argillis. Mm -hmm. It's a green tea beer. Nobody's done it. It's my recipe. If you find somebody that did it already, they lied and they copied off me and report them to the federal, uh, the, the feds, <laughs> FBI. 
Um, so we're going to have an event centered around this green tea beer and also our podcast. We're going to be uh, in the mix doing the podcast, sipping the green tea beer, also a couple other selections mm-hmm. from our Jillis Brewing Company. And uh, it should be the second weekend in May. That's what, I think that's May 15th. And um, I'll check the date. But also, uh, I'll post it up. A little docu docu vlog that uh, uh I put together uh with the help of my boy Bam uh, uh Adam Fisher on on a, on a, on a, on Facebook and um it's pretty dope. It came out pretty cool. It was the first time I did anything like this, and guess who hit the like on that thing? Who's that? I'm not even friends with him, but guess who did it? Who? Oh. The owner dog for shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that thing just dope. shut off. <laughs> Did it? Yeah. All right, boom. I think it's just a timeout thing. We can edit the audio though. You were supposed to bring one of them joints down here too. What? The green teas. See if it. Oh, no, no, no. I ain't even own that in the fridge yet. Oh, okay. But I got one sitting on the side. So okay. I can go ahead. I can throw it in the fridge. All right, boom. Action again. <laughs> My bad. Okay. So yeah, man, we got we got a like from Sam from Dogfish, which is a beautiful thing, and um, because like I respect what they do, and they really jumped it off. Like they started this brewing thing in Delaware. In my opinion, I'm not sure if it's fact. I think it's. They fact. definitely. I would say they <laughs> definitely the biggest. Word. Yeah. They definitely the biggest. Yeah. And um. I really feel like they, uh, cause they always keep a little creativity on hand. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They got the brew house or the brew pub. I'm sorry, and um, they got the uh, then they got the brewery, and uh, they always got a food truck out there. You know what I mean? The food truck. Yeah, they is just crazy. had a. Uh, <laughs> I think they just remodeled. Uh, Did they? Their headquarters or something like that. Okay. Or, okay. You know what I mean. Yeah. Like got a bigger, much bigger spot or something like that. Yeah. I think. Yeah. I remember it was in the paper. <laughs> My man Dom, uh, King Dom Draper from uh, News Journal, he just went down there for a tour. He, um, it was his birthday the other day. Happy birthday, bro. And uh, he um, he did a tour down there, him and his lady. Mm-hmm. And uh, some of the pictures, they, yeah, it, it looked official. It looked yeah. crazy. They on something crazy. Yeah, you feel yeah, me? yeah. I'm waiting on some new stuff. I ain't going to lie. I'm, I haven't been on the, the, the sour beer kick, but that sequence. Yeah, yeah, I told you, man. Yeah. It's dope. <laughs> yeah. It's dope. That's pretty dope. That sequence is good. I'm not going to lie. I, I'm, I was surprised. I was surprised. And it's been a while. Like, the only beer, only other beer I drink right now uh, from Dogfish, not to throw no shade. Hello, y'all. Not to throw no shade. The only beer I'm drinking right now from there is uh, 61 and the 120. You know yeah, the I mean? 120. I like the 120. Yeah. So. No, I actually was a. Uh, I seen um. They got a uh, I forget the name of it uh, but it's a uh, breakfast and a beer. It's yeah, a, I seen that. You know what I mean? Yeah. But I didn't know how I would. You know what I mean? So I just stayed away from that. <laughs> yeah. You know I, mean? but, uh, I think it was a coffee porter, if I'm if I'm if I'm correct. But uh, I just saw that the other day. Mm, yeah. Okay. That breakfast. <laughs> but uh. Oh yeah, but shout out to uh, Boom Sauce. We haven't been talking about you at all. We have not been um, talking about you, Boom Sauce, and there's a reason why. Yeah, that's why you gotta have your, uh, you know. You need to have your, your resume on here. Uh, you see, we got history here, today. But um, where's your history, Boom Sauce? Let's see what this thing hitting for, man. Yeah, let's see what it's about. All they right. ain't even got a story on. The, they don't even have a story. So we got a little son. That's just all they got for us. Uh, Boom Sauce is one of our New England style IPAs. It's a complex, unfiltered beer with great drinkability. Whoa. Keep it cold and drink it fresh. Cheers. Cheers. You know, simplicity, man, at its best. Very true. I guess. Hopefully not at its worst. Let's see what this hit for. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Mm-hmm. Right yeah. off the top, that nose is bananas. Yeah. That's sure. a big nose, man. That's a big nose, like Owen Wilson. That's a big nose. 
that thing in there. Yeah, I like this. It's dope right there. Mm. Sorry if you smack it in your ears and stuff. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, Lord Hobo, you might not have much history posted, but you got some. You got some dope. pretty, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got some pretty deep, uh, some pretty deep, uh, pretty deep uh, 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 feels up in this beer. Now, now, if you had to, uh, you know, <laughs> you know, intertwine it with hip hop. Yeah. What's the first thing that will come to your mind as far as boom sauce or right. anything that's booming besides Metro? Besides Metro. <laughs> if you're a Metro, don't touch you. I'm a street. And um, so I'm like, boom sauce. Hmm. You see, like, I, I tried to keep it in Massachusetts, but it's got to, it's bigger than Massachusetts. I mean, uh, we don't got too many artists to choose from, man. We don't. This, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, and like, the, like, uh, and I'm not sure about you, but you know, yeah. Big shout out to Guru. Yeah. Rest in peace, but, Word. you know, I'm not. That enlightened yeah. on you know Gangstar, Gangstar and yeah, you know you. there you feel me yeah. that's a little bit before my time you know what I mean no so doubt, no doubt they was doing the fish eye lenses in there video yeah you know what yeah, I mean they, and they had some things going on and other than that the only person I mean hip hop anyway rap yeah uh I don't you know no shade or nothing but I don't me really neither, consider though. Benzino uh you know top guy I think. What, well, besides that, you know what? In, no, in regards to hip hop, period. You know what? Yeah. Gotta give a uh, shout out to Benzino because, you know, he was the owner of the Source magazine. He was. You know what I mean? That was a fucking very vital uh, 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 mark right there in hip hop. Yeah. You know, to be on the cover of the Source. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And he still stayed in Ja Rule's corner when all that stuff was going true, on. True, true. I appreciate that because that was my dog right there. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's still my dog. Like, you know, love Ja Rule. Mm -hmm. We just had a Ja Rule night at the crib. We just videoed. I mean, we just pulled up a whole bunch of videos. We was drunk. Don't worry about it. Don't <laughs> think about the details. You know, it's all up. Ja got to get back out here and put some music out, man. <laughs> yeah, straight up. Word. Um, Is that time? But yeah, the Source magazine, we we could definitely big up uh, Benzino on that. Yeah. Um, let's see. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Besides that. Yeah. Besides that, man, <laughs> Bell Bib DeVoe, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Poison. Shout out to New Edition too. Yeah. You know. Shine. Legends in the game, definitely legends in the game. Uh, Everybody loves. I can't even see that one because Johnny Gill wasn't from Boston. <laughs> yeah. Where was Johnny from New York or something? I don't know where the hell Johnny Gill from. Like, I, I, no, I think I, no, I think I think Johnny might have been from the country or something. <laughs> I think he was like a country boy. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know though. Don't know, Shout out man. to Johnny though, man. Word, Johnny, you had it going. Like you had it rocking. Uh, Johnny was a man. Word. Yeah, man. Other than that, little step I take. Bobby Brown. Shout out to Boston, man. Word. Uh, well, actually. Woburn, uh, yeah. but shout out to Boston too. Word. If you're from Woburn, first of all, let us know how to say it. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if y'all say it the same out there. Uh, let us know how to say Woburn in Boston accents. And um, Wobbin. Hey, right, from Wobbin. That's it. Go to Wobbin. Get your beer. <laughs> get a beer in Wobbin. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's it. I don't think that was the right thing to do, cuz. <laughs> no, but it's true, though. Where? Get a beer out of Wobbin. <laughs> I oh, feel man. like that's it. And I love oh, y'all. Don't get it twisted. Like, I love my Boston yeah. people, dog. And, like, every time. Because, I, yo, I did a job out there. I was out there working. You feel me? Mm -hmm. And um, everybody was cool. Like, it was more black people than you expect. And it was like, they... Yo, no, no, on some real shit, man. Uh, 
Shit, Boston got gangs and shit out there. There's a lot of violence out there. I remember I was watching, uh, I don't know, it was something. I don't want to say it was like First 48 or something, but it was like some real live, you know what I'm saying, a show where they was, you know, documenting that type of shit. Yeah. They put them Irish boys serious, on that documentary? It's pretty serious up there. Uh, I know as far as what I was watching, it was just, you know, the, uh, you know, in the hood with it. Black balls. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, um, shout out to Mark Wahlberg. Yeah. Big fan. You know what I'm saying? Very true. Mark and Mark is the man. Like that 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 was that's my guy. Yeah, fucks with Mark Wahlberg. You feel man. me? Like I noticed that I, I noticed I start seeing a lot of uh his name in a lot of fucking credits. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Either doing everything, acting, directing, producing. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Um shit. Hey, how's your mom? <laughs> but if we gonna be talking, we you know I mean, I mean we still gotta keep it hip hop, so yeah, let's go hip hop. Like, let me see. So we got Boom Sauce. This the name itself just takes me to the eighties. You know boom. what I'm saying? Like Boom Sauce. Like I can't, I can't get boom, it. Boom boom <laughs> zoom zoom. Yeah, boom, boom. <laughs> That's the nineties though. <laughs> but yeah, but like who's saying Boom Sauce in 2017? You know what I'm saying? Boom Sauce. That sounds like some like a dude in a in a in a tight jean jacket outfit walking down boom the street sauce. with a collar on. You know what I'm saying? In, a, in, a, in one of them old school hats with the studs around that joint. You know like, what I? Yo, you know you that? Got that boom sauce, baby. <laughs> what you doing? Let's go talk. Do some coke. Uh, <laughs> that's the '80s. And it's, uh, let me see. You know, on that door, Eddie, Eddie, uh, that's the Eddie Kane. You know that Eddie Kane? Here comes the boom. Here comes the boom. DMX. That was the Remember that? It comes the boom. Oh snap! The, the, the reggae joint. No, I do you remember not that? remember that. You remember that? Nah. Used to play that shit at skating all the time, all at the uh, did they parties? I wasn't skating like that. It comes the boom. I don't know how you remember that, man. True. Cause that's a shame. I should. Oh, that song. That song is. Nah, that song I don't like... think that's the right one. Yeah, yeah, that's the one with Mr. Vegas. Yup. That's my man. That sing heads high. Yeah. You remember, you remember that joint? Heads High? Uh-huh. You remember Heads High? I might. You remember this shit? I, I think, I think Big... So. Uh, yeah, Sean Paul on here, too. Is he? Used to play this shit at the house parties, all that shit back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> I think I remember that joint. I do. I do. And what's crazy is I just listened to all the DMX's albums like a couple months ago, like back to back. Classics. Yeah. Yeah, man. Definitely classics. It's crazy. Like, uh, but the last two, I was just like, mm. what the Grand Champion and the other joints. Um, even Grand Champ was good, but the one after that. I'll be honest with you, I was at a point where I wasn't listening to that, and I still maybe I ain't. I yeah. should have gave it a shot, but. <laughs> I was, I was sad, just, bro. You know what I'm saying? I, was I sad, didn't want to. You know what I'm saying? I just I'm, stick to my classics, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm slipping. Fuck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, get up. Why can't you be from Boston so we can be, we can be talking about you right now? You know what I mean? Man, that's because he's from Yonkers, man. You can't, very true. You know? Very true. From Yonkers. Like, don't you ever disrespect me like that? Nah. <laughs> Damn, Shout out crazy. to X, man. Where he is the wildest in the building. You know what I mean? Love DMX, though. But yeah, man. Um, Moon sauce. What does it like? Yeah. It's dangerous. You can't. You know what I mean, you gotta be careful with it too, man. Yeah, it is. Seven point eight. Yeah. And they sold in pints. They not sold in twelve ounces. Yeah, yeah. They sold in pints. It's a little bit more. Um, anything sold in pints, you automatically got to think of like England or Ireland because. They get messed up. Like, they get it in. And whenever they ask for a beer, they say, I want to go for a pint. That's how they talk. I'm not making that up. Am I making that up? I ain't making that up. Watch the movies. you see. Like, you know the truth. <laughs> Choose in the movies. 
<laughs> hey, bloke, I want to go for a pint. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, yo, pint of man. Look at the Golden Mile. If you watch the Golden Mile with, uh, what's my man's name? Uh, he's the British dude. Shaun of the Dead. Uh, Simon Pegg. Why Simon Pegg? Uh, Simon Pegg's mile. moving the Golden Mile, huh? The hell is the Golden Mile? See, right? It was, it's a uh, New Year's Day, right? And I'm thinking that she was talking about the Green Mile, but just had no, no, no. No, it's a literal, it's a real movie. Goddamn. Real movie. Um, Simon Pegg, he, uh, him and his boys, they, uh, it's the, it's, I think it's New Year's or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, they got a list of bars that they go through. They're supposed to have a, a they call it a pint. We got to have a pint at each bar. Mm-hmm. So 12 different bars. Mm-hmm. And um, they call it the Golden Mile. So every, um, what are they doing? So once they, they never finished it. They only got like, Six or five bars in, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying, in their history. So this night, there's a alien invasion. <laughs> oh, shit. So like they making it to each bar, but they killing aliens at the same time. Oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? And like it's it's just ridiculous, and it's fun, and it's British people saying we want to go for a pint. That's what you know. Anything sold in a pint is for the English and the Irish. You gotta love them because they know how to get down and they know good beer. Yeah, it's definitely New England style IPA. Word. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. I'm just I'm just lost on the on the name though. Like, why Boom Sauce? Does it sound cool somewhere? Yeah, it's a kicker. Is it kicker? Yeah, I mean. Sh- mm. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Mm-hmm. That just opened up some hip hop for me. It's a kicker. Mm-hmm. So like, you know, kicks. Mm-hmm. What's kicks in hip hop? The drum, mm-hmm. the bass drum. Mm-hmm. What, in your opinion, had some really dope bass drums in their production? Who got like the best drums in their production? Let's take this to the producers. <laughs> boom sauce, cause who got the boom? Was that the song we just listened to? What? Here comes the boom. Oh, here comes the boom. Who got the boom was a song from the nineties, wasn't it? Who know. got the boom? Who got? Nah, that was that's the same shit. song. It is the same song. I think I feel like he recreated that shit. All right, but anyway, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, but so <laughs> who got the boom in the hip hop production area? Who got that boom sauce when they put the boom in there? When they put the boom in? Not uh, just one song. You mean just? Period. Overall, a producer. yeah, Period. producers. You know what I'm saying? Who got that booming sound? Mm. And we ain't just talking about Metro booming. Metro booming got a hell of a bounce to his mm-hmm. beats. I'm not going to deny that. Mm-hmm. I love them. Yeah, dope. I love them joints. Mm-hmm. But who got them booming beats that really is deserving of the title of the Boom Sauce King? <laughs> I'm automatically go with Timberland, man. Oh damn! Yeah, yeah. I'm automatically go with Tim. Automatically. Automatically. Okay, 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 okay. Hands okay. down, you know. Why? <laughs> Why? Tim, Timberland, not only got the boom sauce, but he makes his own boom sauce. Right. And variations, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Different with his mouth. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. With his mouth. He, he he literally is the sauce. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> he, yeah. Like like he got the juice. And it's and it's different. It's not just one lane. Like you know, like with most producers, mm-hmm. where they got a, uh, you know, like they get stuck into a one lane or a certain sound or yeah. You know, once they pop, and then you got people that's coming from everywhere like uh oh you need one of these type songs for you like you need a dj mustard song for your album or or, you know what i'm saying like yeah or or you need a lex luger joint yeah you know what i'm saying a little beats one or something you know what i'm saying everybody can make you know what i mean but when you not everybody can make a timberland joint yeah exactly i could dig that you know what i'm saying and then he's so versatile you know what i mean yeah 
That's crazy. Now, let me see for a second. Let me think right quick. Because that was a slobber knock. Mm-hmm. That was a boom saw, boom saw slobber knock. Right, right. <laughs> uh, I think I know what you're going to say. It looked like I was about to say a whole bunch, right? Um, I want to say this one guy, but like, he always got help. You feel me? But like, he always put his polish on there to make it crazy. I mean, it ain't nothing wrong with help, you know? That's very true. So, excuse me. I was about to say Dre. Dre. I was about Dr. to. Dr. Dre. Yeah, I was about okay. to say Dre first. Okay. But then I started thinking about this guy. Okay. Who's got Dre? Definitely got boom sauce. Dre got boom sauce. Hell Word yeah. since the eighties. Hell yeah. Um. What about what I knew about you was going to say yay. Kanye West. I knew you was going to say yay. Word. That's what I said. I know what you going to say. I know, man. <laughs> this is the second time I mentioned him in the podcast, too. Word. Like, what about Kanye? Yeah, yeah. He definitely got them shits. His you know? production? Hell yeah. Now, I ain't going to lie. Starting off, because he, he was in the same camp as... Uh, now, I got this info from Arsonist. From the uh, Heat Excuse Makers. Me. They was all in the same camp. Kanye, arsonist. Shout out to Heat Makers, too. Word, shout out to y'all. Man, listen. We're going to get back to that. Um, you didn't say Kim. Kanye. Hey, you might want, yeah. They definitely got some boom sauce, too. Yeah. You're damn right the Heat yeah, Makers got some boom sauce. They definitely got some boom sauce. Word. They definitely got Word, some boom sauce. Word, they ran. Like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they held Late it. Late 90s and the early they had, 2000s. They, yeah, they held it down. It you was know what I'm saying? Hell of a, yeah. And then people started copying their shit. Mm-hmm. Like crazy, you know what Try I mean. Trying to take the sauce, yeah. Try Word. to take the sauce and, 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 and run off with it. You know exactly. how it goes. So uh, now with Kanye, um, he was in the same camp with Arsonist and Just Blaze. You know mm-hmm, what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And uh, I forgot who else Arsonist mentioned to me, but Guru. It Yo, had Guru. to be, yeah. Yeah, but Young Goo was mostly an engineer. He wasn't producing. Oh, okay. You know okay. what I mean? And um, they was, like, competing with each other. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we were, we uh, one day we, we were just talking about the Yeezus album. And he was like, yeah, he was like, he was like, I hear, you know, some Kanye. Uh, <laughs> he was like, I hear Kanye's production in there. Matter of fact, cut action it's visual though so yep that's gonna be more yeah enticing it's gonna be dope. you know what i'm saying so it's gonna be real though. and we get more time on youtube you good okay. yeah i still got some um I yeah what you say action uh, 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 uh just blazing up the uh so it's it's only it's only natural that uh starting out kanye sounded a little like just blaze you feel me Matter of fact, did Just Blaze do Through the Wire? Or was that Kanye? Uh, that's Kanye, I believe. Kanye did a production on there, right? Kanye did most of... You see, Kanye came with a newer wave. Like, I won't say a newer wave, but he was... He... he, he that's when he was in his sample bag. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Bringing them classic hits yeah. with them samples on it. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So, and it really was like a resurgence of... You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And Just Blaze is doing the same thing. Yeah. But, but Kanye definitely... You know what I'm saying, and yeah. then he had everybody else following it. Yeah, it was the it was the, the thing that Kanye did that was the differentiator was the high pitch of the samples. Yeah, exactly, you know what exactly, I'm exactly. And um, you know that's one thing he talked about. <laughs> Excuse me, in his uh, in his in his uh, interviews too. But what's crazy is I've really listened to like his drums. You know what I mean, mm-hmm. and the one like power let's go to power no one man should have all mm-hmm. that man mm-hmm. listen to me right? yo but oh my gosh even God. before that uh yeah. what was it um even through the wire I had some crazy the drums. shit where he had um 
<laughs> where he had um. I still make drums. Where like he that. had Jeezy ad libs on it. Oh, amazing! It's no, amazing. no, no, not that. Um, yeah. Before that, that uh, I had a dream I could buy my way to heaven. When I woke, I spent yes, it on a necklace. Can't tell me nothing. Can't tell me nothing. That's my what phone, it is. That joint. Yeah. That joint. That beat was yeah. crazy as a motherfucker. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, very true. That was hard. Oh. Yeah, that was dope. That was dope. Yeah, that was dope. Yeah, that's the joint. Who did that beautiful morning beat? Beautiful morning. Oh yeah, uh, finally stretch my hands. Metro. Oh okay okay. Yeah. But you yeah, know yeah, he don't yeah. take no beats from nobody don't. that don't he don't that yeah, he true. don't touch. Yeah yeah true true. You know what I'm saying? So like you hear Kanye's touches on there, mm-hmm. and um, like one thing that's synonymous with Kanye is the congas, the conga, the conga drums or the tom toms or whatever. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like you always hear them, and um, I really love those joints. Like I, I put them in like two of my beats, and. That just reminded me of that that fucking Ryan Leslie. Yes, exactly. You know what I'm saying? That's another one. Yeah, that's Addic- another addiction. Yo, that's one of yeah. yeah listen, that like, see, I don't just that's put that. Sauce. See that? See him? That's a boom. I don't sauce. just yeah. That's fucking boom sauce right there. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I don't just consider that motherfucker a producer though. Like that motherfucker, a, literally artist. like a artist. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like a straight up. You playing a whole <laughs> different type of instruments yourself. Yeah. You know Everything, what I'm saying? Man. He I, had, I seen the motherfucker yeah, making was, the beat, ordered the shit. That was ignorant. That was just ignorant. Like you yeah. know what I'm saying? Ordered the shit live. Word. Yeah, I, I pay an extra for yeah. it to get here an hour. Shit gets there, you taking the shit out the rapper and everything, then just come on, man. Not only did it get there fast, but it was beautiful. It was like black had a polish yeah, on smoke, it. Smoke, yeah. You know what I'm saying? A little French horn. Yeah, get out of here, shit man. Was, yeah. Get on Ryan Leslie. Don't be disrespectful. Yeah, he's like just that. A, you an asshole. No, man. He's just, just an asshole. That was messed up. That was that. That was that Rockefeller money. <laughs> <laughs> That's that Rockefeller money, man. And like, I, I'm jealous, but I love you though. It's still love. I hope we can make some music soon. Definitely motivation. Hopefully you brought... Did you find the people who stole your laptop? I think like, he Ben got that back. He did? I think so. That's what's up. He said he was going to get somebody like $10 million or something for it. It was a million dollars. It was a million? I, you see how exaggeration works? <laughs> Boy, that's, that's real. Shit, that's, that's, that's a lot of shit, though. I mean, you know, Word, you that's mean. a lot of boom sauce. <laughs> you know you got some shit on that motherfucker. His laptop was like a 40-ounce of boom sauce. Word. <laughs> Word. Let's see, y'all. Uh, oh, my light died on me. But yeah, um, it must be the ghost. Keep. Matter of fact, yeah, yeah. Talk to me, Jack. Yeah, man. Um. Other than that, some more producers. Uh, can't forget about Pharrell. True. Uh, you know. Shit. Uh. Let me see. I'm forgetting, I'm forgetting my, 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 my top dogs. <laughs> forgetting my top dogs right now. Yeah, forget about Swizzy. Definitely Swizzy. Definitely Swizzy. Shout out to Swiss, man. Word. And that, yo, man, that fucking studio is dope as shit, too. Yeah, it is. That shit is dope. What you recording there again? Uh, what was that? Uh, What track was that? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Get lost. Um <laughs> shit. You got Swiss, you got um DJ Premier, man. Hell yeah, he's the boom sauce. Keep it all way hip hop, you know. Shout out DJ Premier. Uh I see who else we got. Uh shit. Hmm. I'm forgetting a lot of fucking uh Producers right now, forgive me. Mr. Boom Sauce. Uh, I guess you can shout out uh, Mustard, as we were speaking about earlier, holding it down, keeping his run. Got Boom Sauce. Uh, I'm forgetting. About, I'm forgetting a lot of legends right now. Uh, this is not coming off to me at the back right now. I'm trying to deal with this shit. Excuse me. But yeah, man, uh, shout out to y'all, man.
appreciate y'all for following us, you know. Nerd Up Movement. Join us, you know. Tag a friend. Tell them to tag along. Follow, you know. This is what we doing, man. And as you know, we got uh, Rob D. Shout out Relamar, my nigga, too. He's definitely a producer with Boom Sauce. Uh, if y'all don't know, go follow my dog. Super dope producer, you know. Crazy artist, you know. Yeah, all that, uh, man. Um, shout out to my dog, Drizzy Get Busy, too. Dope producer with Boom Sauce. Oh, man. Shout out to PC Beats. We're going to keep it local right now. I'm keeping it local. PC Beats. Crazy on the muff. He definitely got boom sauce. Oh man, the list just goes on, man. Um, yeah, man, nerd up, man. Join the movement, man. We doing our thing, supporting y'all, support us. You know, we gonna continue to uh put out these dope vibrations, these good vibrations, and you know, <laughs> let everything be reciprocate, reciprocated. Excuse me, it's the boom sauce. Reciprocated But yeah uh, Shout out to Argillas one more time man Hope to see you soon I apologize I couldn't make the last uh, Meeting um, Got trapped up in work man I, I, You know I apologize uh, But I definitely look forward to seeing you guys soon And meeting you and you know Spreading more love You know Enlightening more people on the brewery company. The brewing company, excuse me. Um, yeah, man, we about to log off, though. My co-host didn't have to take a, uh, a brief intermission, you know. But, yeah, man, hope y'all enjoyed this episode, man. We gonna keep doing what we do. Beats and Brews podcast, and any any anything that y'all would like us to, uh, you know, speak on, join the conversation, man. We can have the, you know, the top five MCs conversation, the top five producers, type top five songwriters, you know, uh, all that, you know. Beats and Brews, man, definitely the, uh, and and you know, comment your your, your top five. Beers, you know, leave a list down for us to try out, and 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 we can, you know, do a podcast on, and uh, you know, spread the word and give our opinion, you know. It's nerd up visions, you know. Hope y'all enjoyed this. By the log off. One love. Word up to the nerd up. Stay dope. One.